Hey y'all, welcome back to what I'm on today. Today we are talking about spring bags. What am I gonna be wearing this spring? What are gonna be my top bags? So stay tuned. Thankful for this beat. Thankful for my dad, man, he kept me from the street. Man, I'm thankful when I eat. Thankful for my wife. Thankful for my freak. When they saw each other last week. They Hey y'all, welcome back to What I'm On Today. My name is Lakia Chanel and I make videos about all things handbags, both luxury and contemporary because you guys already know that I do not discriminate. And we also talk about whatever it is that I am on today. So today, it has started to get nice. Now, let me put a caveat on that. Nice some days, okay? But because of that, I have definitely revamped my display which um i literally do probably every two months i am somebody who loves change and i love changing things around and especially with my bags because i have so many probably last year i adopted this idea that i would like switch out my bags right so that i wouldn't always have to number one feel cluttered looking at all of them and number two i wanted to wear them more so less options means that i get a chance to wear them more and so then that turned into kind of this thing where it's like okay i change it up every couple of months um some are staples on the shelf because they're all year round and then my shelf really does focus on like the bags that I'm going to be wearing for that particular season. So right now we are in spring. Some of these bags will probably stay um, until summer as well. Um, but these are all like my fun colors and my light browns and my beiges and my whites that I'm going to be wearing for this summer. So instead of going over every single bag, I'm going to pick like my top bags that I'm really know that I'm going to get a ton of wear off of. And then I'm also going to show you at some point in the video, like what my current um, just all the bags that I have on the shelf that will be getting some wear um, this season. So I'm going to start over on this side, which is pretty much the, 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 the side that has blacks in, in various different colors. So let's let's go over there. OK, we are on this side. As you can see, if you follow my channel, I feel like the bags over here I switched them up a little bit, got some Telfar, got my Tory Burch, and then like I just love this Nike bag, so I want to see it all the time. So that's there, although I probably won't be wearing it in this warm season, but these will be some of the totes that I'm definitely going to be rocking. You guys can't see, but I have some black bags up here. This bag here is my new boo. I have to have, I feel like regardless of the season, you have to have a black bag that is going to wear with you all season long, right? So this is going to be the black bag. Actually, these two. These two will be the black bags that I'm going to be wearing because they're denim. And I feel like it goes with, you know, summer, spring. I do have some bags at the top too, which you guys will see at the end of this video. But I do want to give a shout out to my clear Telfar bag. I didn't love this when I first got it, but this actually was a pretty great staple uh, last summer. It went to the beach with me. It's a great work bag, although it's kind of heavy, like it's heavy on its own. But this was so cool. Like if you need a beach bag that you can throw around, you can get sand in, throw some water in and it's perfect. This is the bag. You guys already know I've talked about this bag, my Kirk Geiger. Um, this is the Kensington Extra Extra Large. Love this bag. I cannot wait to wear this bag. A couple of things that I've done to some of these bags where I just am going to love them even more is I have become an engineer, engineer day bags, and I put some paper clips. I have these little metal paper clips and I have created a kind of top handle situation for a couple of these large bags and that is going to make me super happy and so I know that I'm going to wear this a lot this summer. You guys already know this baby. No introduction needed. She's going to be around for sure. This was one of my most worn bags last year during this time. It is probably going to be my most worn bag. I feel like for some reason pink is not my favorite color but I'm so drawn to it. Um, and I feel like for whatever reason, this shade goes with everything. And because of the ease of just wearing this bag, it's a, it's the cutest tote bag ever, right? Um, 
it's it's just gonna be something that I'm gonna throw stuff in and wear so much. You guys can't see below, but I am gonna do a special shout out to this little MCM bag. I think I got this last year or the year before last, and I wanted it so badly! And I have worn it like a handful of times. So I feel like this year I am really going to wear it a ton. I'm going on vacation soon. And for me, a vacation bag is a small crossbody bag. So I might be pulling her out for vacay. We, I gotta get the outfits together, but we gonna see. Now let's talk a little bit about this middle rack here. Okay, so I feel like this has a lot of goodies in here. These are all of my kind of whites and purples and blues here and i forgot to mention like the whole chanel rack here i'm definitely going to be wearing the white chanel no you already know that i'm really going to try my best to wear this holy grail bag a lot more this summer and a lot more than i've worn it you know in the past mama's got to get her money's worth out of that one so we're gonna find some fits in the closet that are gonna do this justice um She's going to be a staple. She is always, always a staple for the spring and summer and probably early fall. Um, it is, there's something about the doctor shape of this bag. It's, it's giving tote vibes, but closed tote vibes. So that means that I can throw everything in here that I need and more and be good. And I feel like in the spring, summer, she goes with just everything. So I love her. She needs no introduction. She's going to be worn all summer. She is. She goes with everything and this is just her life. I am going to wear her more this summer. For some reason, my little YSL babies, specifically the YSL Toy Lulus, I don't wear them as much. And I really like this bag. Like this is like a whole vibe. And I had the audacity when the Coach Quilted Tabbies came out to jump on that bandwagon of like, oh my gosh, they need a pink or purple denim one. Ma'am. Okay. So I'm going to wear her much more this summer because I have a lot of purples and pinks like in my wardrobe. And I think from a pastel and color blocking perspective, she's going to be a vibe. So I engineered this baby girl too. So I'm already loving it so much. You guys know about this Kurt Geiger bag. Now, you know, she's not the best quality bag, but mama's going to get her whole wear. Like she's such a stunner. Um, she's going to get worn. She's going to have so much fun with me um, this spring and this summer. She needs no introduction. <laughs> I feel like she is oftentimes definitely in that most worn category. Again, just because of the ease of a tote bag. And I don't know if I said this, I was never a tote bag girl. I was a flat girl. You give me every flap in the world I'm going to wear her and love her. And I probably about a year ago when I started, maybe a year or two ago, specifically when I started getting into booty, I, and kind of that Hermes journey situation, I have loved these kind of really nice tote bags. So um, she's going to get worn a ton. She always does. And so that's just that. Now I put her up here because this is a wish bag. I wish I wore her more bag. Um, if you guys saw some videos last year, you know, I probably wore this thing maybe one time since I made that video last year. <sighs> I'm going to try my best. The idea of this bag is so good. The color is so rich. I don't know why. I'm just not drawn to wearing it, but I put it on the shelf because when you're on the shelf, that means that you have a very strong chance of getting worn. I have to do a special shout out to this young lady. She's on the bottom shelf so you cannot see her. Pillow Tabby, size 26. I'm obsessed with her. She's going to be worn so much this summer. Um, and she fits like, she fits so much. And so, yeah, she's getting worn so much this summer. She's on the hot list. All right, we're going to move over to the second side of the wall. Okay, so you are, you guys already know, like, I am so excited to have this little baby. So I got her last year. She is on that denim vibe. 
And um, because she's light denim, she goes with everything. Like she even looks super cute with what I have on today. Um, so I am so excited to be wearing her. So she's a winner, winner chicken dinner. She needs no introduction, okay? The Bottega, I mean, honestly, it's so weird. I don't know why I don't have more specifically of the padded cassette because it is literally one of my most worn luxury bags in my collection. I'm going on vacation as I mentioned. So she is probably maybe got to see what fits I'm taking one of the bags that I'm going to be taking with me because she's so comfortable and she fits so much and I love her and she held up so well. Like I literally again, I have thrown her around. I'm not I'm not super gentle with her. She's she's everything and the leather is beautiful. Get into Bottega if you if you're in, I'm into Bottega. Get into Bottega if you can. Or if you're interested. Um, got these two babies here. I do not wear her as much as I want to, but she's so cute. So she is going to be one of the blue vibes for the summer. She's probably going to be on the list as well for um, winter too. You'll see her both both all seasons. Same with the um, the Ralph Lauren Ricky in the size 26. I, I haven't done a full video on her just yet. It's coming soon, but um, she's going to be worn in the summer again, just kind of like that booty bag. This size and just being able to throw everything in it is such, uh, it's so easy. So she's going to get a ton of wear. Here, you guys see my denim bays. I have my Brandon Blackwood um fits a lot of stuff this is a shoulder bag so i feel like she's going to get worn probably not worn you know as much as maybe something else because she's not crossbody um our little coach bay here denim is going to be on okay um so she's gonna definitely get some wear and then we've got some of our um our hermes girly so this is one that like stays on the shelf all year round um, she is a bag that I'm actually, oh, I'm actually in her right now. So she has like all the stuff packed in her and, um, she's going to get, she's going to get some wear. Um, when I'm into my big bag in it, she's going to get some wear and she's so beautiful. Like the colorway is a vibe. Her sister, which is the her bag, same same vibe i'm gonna try to wear her a little bit more this one is a little bit more finicky a little less easy in my opinion to use um and i feel like i need to spray her down with scotch guard i took her to the movies a couple of weeks ago and she fell and so she has like some dirt marks that i'm gonna work on you know cleaning off and maybe getting her a spray down so she can be like more waterproof than than not this is the bag that i thought about selling I got her, I got her in Lisbon last year on one of my European trips and I was like, oh, you know, I don't know what it is, y'all. When I be going to these foreign countries, I get crazy in these stores. And so, but now I love her. Like she's so cute. And I think the size, this is called the favorite, the new favorite that they came out with. And I feel like the size is again, like really good to put all your basics in there. You can have a full size wallet in here. And so I feel like she's kind of been getting a lot more wear than when I first got her. And that's why guys keep your bags for a little bit. My, this is my opinion. I realize that sometimes I feel like I love a bag. I'll buy the bag. I won't wear it as much as I thought I would, right? And sometimes my inclination is like, okay, well, let me get rid of this bag because I start to feel overwhelmed because I have so many and blah, 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 blah. And sit on it. Like a lot of times when I sit on a bag for a bit, I start loving it and I wear it all the time. So um, that's why I kind of take my time giving things away or selling them because at some point I feel like I'm going to come around and like really want the bag to be like a part of my day to day. And, and okay, she's definitely getting worn. This is the coach fanny pack. This is the only fanny pack that I have in my collection because honestly, I don't need any more fanny packs. Okay. That's not, I'm not a fanny pack girl, but this I love, I'm an outdoor girl now. So I love to hike. I love to be outside. 
and when I am doing all those things this summer I literally am gonna wear this fanny pack I have this fanny pack this is this is like literally my hiking pack my hiking fanny pack so um, definitely going to be a whole entire staple this um, this summer all right the last part are these loveys here um, special shout out to this young lady here um this is the coach bandit my only bandit i thought i was gonna have a thousand of these but um in the lime green i have not worn this as much as i want to wear it and i am hoping that she gets a lot of reach this summer because she is fire and I, i'm looking at my like shoe wall right here and i have like at least three or four pair of shoes that five pair of shoes that really kind of bring out like she'll bring out the color of those shoes so i'm excited to definitely get somewhere out of her my bottega bay um this is the one that has the little gold uh adornments on it i like this one it's because it's so easy so i was kind of so the last time i went to lisbon i for whatever reason lisbon like I'm going to try to get something from Bottega and YSL always gets my money. I don't know why, but, um, I saw this, the freaking padded cassette, which is what I wanted to do was like literally $4,000. And so even with that and everything, I would have spent like either 35 or $3,000 on that bag. And I paid 1900 for mine. So I just couldn't stomach it. And so I got this one. I ended up getting this, I want to say for 15 or $1,900 back then. And I love it. It's super easy. The closure is easy. I just throw a whole bunch of stuff in here and get going. So this little cassette bag, um, I'm definitely going to be trying to wear her. And the color, I mean, the green is graining, okay? You guys know, you've seen her before. She is Bay. I love this bag. I plan on wearing her. She is my uh, Purification Garcia bag. I went back to Lisbon specifically to get her because I knew I wanted, um, I wanted one of these bags. So love this. It feels so beautiful. And so when I'm like being grown up this summer, I'm going to be pulling her out. These are the like the all year bays, okay? Am I going to wear these a ton? I don't think so, but they're here. They're part of the browns, okay? I feel like this, I did not wear a ton last year. Part of this because my husband is not a backpack guy. He doesn't like when I wear backpacks for some reason, but I love this and I need to put this back into rotation. So she is on the shelf because she's getting back on rotation for beautiful, casual, gray vibe. All right, this little baby, okay? I did not get a chance to wear her as much as I wanted to last summer. She is definitely on my hit list to wear as much as possible this summer. And I cannot wait to wear her crossbody again because like she's so cute. Like it's a whole other pineapple. I cannot get over how great this particular bag is. It's so good. So anyways, I cannot wait. And she she's going to be, I'm not going to call her a staple, but she's going to be highly highly seeking to wear all right this spring summer and lastly we have this little bit babe this little baby here i feel like when the um louis vuitton speedy in the size 30 and the um uh dami azure isn't being worn this is going to be her smaller baby i really do enjoy this i do feel like for such a small bag it fits like a lot of stuff so i do plan on wearing her a good a good a good porch in the spring and those are the bags those are the highlights of the bags that i will be wearing um i'm going to show you guys like i mentioned an overview of all the bags because there are a few tote bags up here that are definitely going to be worn as well for work or travel um because they're so oversized i probably won't be wearing them for like every day day-to-day -day stuff but anyways hope you enjoyed this video i do want to see the spring bags that you guys are going to be pulling out this year so if you do a video like this please tag me in it because I want to see it if you have any questions about any of the bags that I have here do feel free to comment and I will get back to you and I appreciate you guys uh spending yet another day with what I'm on today don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys soon bye I'm thankful thank